Hello everybody and thank you for joining another Strider Force J gameplay. And I want to welcome everyone back to the Strider Zone. Rock a little bit of the Skyrim and continue what we're doing. Um, just want to give everybody a heads up. We're actually, um, um, pretty much what I did yesterday, I actually uh, turned myself into a vampire, I, you know, um, and um, pretty much got all the perks uh, yesterday. So... I wanted to knock, you know, I knocked it off on the previous thing, uh, which was pretty cool. You know what I mean? Uh, wasn't too bad. It wasn't too bad. Hello, give me one second, everybody, before we start off. Got to make sure that uh, uh, I can see how it's coming through. Yeah, because I had one time, I had a real good stream one time, bro. Real, real, real good stream. And what happened was <laughs> I... Um, I forgot to um, to check it to see if it was coming through. <laughs> so it was. Um, I, I wasn't happy, dude. I was like, "No, I can't believe it! I can't believe it!" So um, and let me make sure. What's up? Why well, I can't see it? Like, what's what is up? Let me type it in real quick. Give me one second. Sorry about that, everyone. That's where Well, it's all good in the hood. As long as we got that one, that's all that matters. Yeah, we got me a wife. Yeah, I finally got the the vampirism out. Yeah, I actually showed off all the, the majority of um, um of techniques. I think the other one I'm trying to see some other people that I can. It's a goat man. Watch out. What time is it? It's four in the morning. All right, let's bring it up a little bit. Just a couple. To see if um I know you said you had a few people out here. Let me see. Let me see if I can find characters out there. He's another one. A sad time. Yes, and I couldn't tell you why. My wife and I think there's some dark magic at work. Or perhaps RK's influence is strong here, and he likes to keep it this way. Good to talk to you. You, you. Where you go? Oh, Falkreath is a hard place, and tending a farm here is thankless work. See if we can, um... Let's go in here and check it out. Nobody in here. That's weird. Damn. He was one of the people that I had to do the, um, that sucks. Yeah, I'll put him over here with the rest of the, um, 
That was probably when the dragon came. Dragon tore his ass up. Yeah, he's one of the followers. I mean, he's one of the boys that would um, that I would help that would help me out. That sucks. Freaking dragon tore his ass up. Find a nice little place for his ass. That is good. You can rest easy. Do I got the mask on? What I got? Let's see. 94. Yeah, I think I got everything I'm supposed to have on to bring up the weight. Yeah. There we go. Got the the mask of fate maybe somebody over here maybe kind of messed up yeah the dragon must have attacked from back here and just started burning people down that fucker i got uh, too bad you make it all the sons and daughters of falkreath Well, he was supposed to be the man in here. He got. Now you got. You, you still got a girl in here that can help me out. That's all I need is one more. I ain't trying to steal from you, so I'm trying to put that back. That's yours. Monk groves. That's it. Kind of sucks, though. All right, well, he's gone. And then I can do. Just got to find uh, somebody else. What, well, I need one more favor, right? To, um, let's see. Yeah, I got to assist one more person so I can become fame of the area, but... see nobody else to that was a girl too but I, I haven't seen her she tell you yeah, it's some chick that if you cut wood for her let me check the map real quick hey yeah, that dragon really messed shit up man all the dead I can't really help you. I'm just ten years mate. All right, well then, don't worry about it. Let's check in the barracks or something. Yeah, that dragon came and messed shit up big time. Sit. Watch the skies, traveler. Yeah, we're trying. I've a lot of respect for the up. restoration school. Skyrim could use more healers. That's what this is where the 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 liking do is that. sucks yeah I can't I'm hoping I can find that one person yeah cause you had a girl around here that you can cut wood but I don't see her at all
Yeah, she says, cut me some wood. And, um, and we'll square away some of that. But I don't see her. I just hope she didn't get killed by the freaking dragon. But we'll go from house to house, see what's up. That's the Yarrow boy. Yeah, that's the Yarrow square. I ain't gonna go in there yet. We went in there. Let me see something. Yeah, that's the front door. That's my man right there. But the thing is, she's supposed to be out here. Some chick, some girl is supposed to be out here. And she says, uh, you cut me some wood. Honest work for Onyx pay, some shit like that, that's what she says. Teacup, the hall is filthy. See to your cleaning. My cousin's yes, out sir. fighting dragons, oh. and what do I get? God, you think. You're not as dumb as you look. Got to keep my eyes open. Get damn dragons. Let's see if I can get in here. Oh man, it's like her house is like uh, got locked. This is locked as well. That's this dude's house, lad, right? Yeah, lad's crib. Oh, uh, hmm. We got too many places. And she got we got Miss Flirty girl right there. Falkreath was once full of wanderers and warriors like yourself. Those were better days. Yeah, I don't see anybody. Like, uh, I don't even see that girl, bro. She's supposed Welcome to be to around. Dead I escaped fighting in Cyrodiil, only to have it track me down again in Skyrim. Here, take a look at this. Some of the Jarl's men came by and left this bounty letter. Let me see. I remember. Be sure to share it with me. All right, cool, cool. I think if I remember, Short she's at the bones. end. Handsome man in Falkry. <laughs> Let me see. Yeah, he got killed by the dragon. This just sucks. I don't think I know where she's at. Well, I guess we're not getting this. I mean, uh, being uh, theme in this zone. Oh well. well. Let's go do this mission real quick. We'll, we'll, we'll worry about it later. Yeah, cause I don't see her. She's supposed to. She's supposed to be like she's some girl supposed to be uh, she's supposed to be out there I can't remember yeah cause you got a total of three people damn you got lit up son Take that bracelet. Get ready. Trouble ahead. Oh shit, I got oh, okay, that's the sound. Go around that. I gotta shoot that in the air to the sky. So like that I can I can get that achievement uh when you shoot the the technique in the sky. Huh? That brat ain't mine. What was that? Go ahead. Try and fight that. 
do better than that. Yeah, she did them dirty as shit. Well, good shit, wifey. Man, we gotta go to. Damn, my man dies sitting up. Something cool. Yeah, I, got, I can sell that. Uh, I can keep that. Yeah, because I've been here already, that's why. Don't see that every day. It's a female too, man. That's corny, dude. Female freaking bandit leader. It's not cool. I know people be like, yo, that's racist. Nah, nah, it's not. Just, I don't get a kick out of, you know, fighting the ladies. It's not cool. I gotta fight dudes and monsters, demons, that's right, crush them all. Die. Are you serious? Come on, let's go get this chunk. We out. I ain't gonna lie, man. It feels damn good that I can. That I don't have to worry about the. I ain't gotta worry about. Um, she'll probably come back in 24 hours or some shit. Oh, well, I don't fucking know. But that dude got wrecked. Cause he was a mission that you had to do, but he got killed by the dragon. The dragon's still there, so. Well met. Unlike my brother, I've no dislike of strangers. What is lots of them while I was a storm cloak. Are we good? What's this one? Maybe she's there on the evening. Let me go look real quick. 
Can you get a female? Come on in. Just stoke the fire. Take a seat and get the cold out. Yeah, I don't see her, man. Welcome Handsome to Dead Man's fun. Drink. You hear any juicy Machine gossip in gun. town? Be sure to share it with me. Falkreath was once full of wanderers and warriors like yourself. Those were better days. Well, I mean, it's cool. If I can't become Thane from this area, I'm not really worried about it. I can just, um, what's that called? Um, it just, it just, you got a couple NPCs that are missing and it's kind of like stupid. Is that her? No. is a kind and wise man. The Nords could use more like him. So could the Imperials. And this should be locked, I think. Yeah. Where is, uh, there you go. The Jarl's crit. Well, that's technically helping out the villagers. I mean, if you think about it, I'm... Clean out the drama. Hold on a second, everybody. Right, I am back, back, back. <sighs> I'm trying to see where where that person is. Oh man.
I'm the steward here. Excellent. You've done us a great service. Here is your reward. May wisdom forever light your path. This is an old disguise. A strong drink will chase off that chill in the air. I escaped fighting in Cyrodiil, only to have it track me down again in time. days come and gone, for the age of aggression. Skyrim's history of war is well documented here, in Falkreath's graveyard. And restore what we own, the blood and A sad time. Good to talk to you. Down with Ulfric, the killer of kings. On the day of your death, we will drink and we'll sing. We're the children of Skyrim, and we fight all our lives. And when Southern Guard beckons, every one of us dies. At some point, we should hire Tekla on here. If she could just but spend this less time serving ours, and we'll see it wiped ah, clean. I wish I could afford to pay you both. that has I so really do. Our hopes and our dreams. Sorry about that, everybody. And, uh, um, yeah, man, I was trying to see if I can find them dudes, man, but she is... I don't think I found her yet. She's part of Far Cree with some female in general at the sawmill, but I don't see her at all. I hope she didn't get killed. Maybe I can pick up some pavages for him and he'll pay me. Maybe that'll be considered. I don't know. Um. Yeah, this is this is the bull from here, but he got killed. He moved his back a little bit. There you go. That looks a little better. Yeah, he got killed and shit by the freaking dragon. So there ain't nothing I can really do when the other... Yeah, you need the old guy, the one that I, that I found dead. You need him to find the other guy, so. That got effed up. What time is it in the game? Well, we can wait around for a couple. Of... We can wait a little bit. Maybe doing him the favor. You know, like, uh, where is he at? Matthias or some shit like that, or something like that, give or take. There's supposed to be a girl. I remember her. <laughs> oh, man. Maybe he's in here. Let me see if he's in here already. Because there's two, two ways you can find them, but hopefully. Let me see, where is he at? There you go. A sad time. Honest pay for honest work. Good to talk to you. Likewise, likewise. Yeah, she, I don't see her, These dude. Graves hold the suns. It's like she's supposed to be around here. Like I said, I hope she didn't Show get killed by the damn dragon. Like she's around the mill. She said around the sawmill. Um, let me see if I see her name. I think I'm missing it. It's probably here. 
It's probably out in the outskirts right here, probably. Yeah, because he's dead. Hall of Dead Ball. <laughs> All right. Yeah, she's a chick that you, she hangs around the mill. She hangs around the mill. And she says, oh, if you cut me some wood. Um, but I don't see her at all. I'm talking about at all, at all, at all. Let's see what. It's probably around here somewhere. Or probably I didn't find the mill yet that's connected to it. Probably a little higher than. Wasn't meant to be to become a thing in this crooked ass place anyway, so. Well, I guess we'll continue our adventure. We'll come back to this later on. I'm trying to find that, that, that chick, dude. Determined. Yeah, she. I know I put a marker for somewhere we had to go back. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I can't wait to start playing with the mods, man. Like you know, like I seen a lot of the. Um, A lot of the places. I don't see her. Well, I guess she's. She probably got killed too by the dragon or some shit. That's the barracks. I do one last sweep. That's the girl. Uh, that's him. The yarl. Let me see the yarl got something for me. My work. She probably she's probably in here. You never know, but she's a little cutie though. She's a little you know what I mean. She ain't, she's a she a hot little Joe. Um, Sid Gear can sometimes act too quickly, but he does no. listen to Helbert and I. Let me see. Nope. Nope. No nah, girl, we can't go in here and get our get our wildness on. We gotta do it out here. Talk to the Legion's dude. always looking. Can't wait to kill another of Ulfric's boys. Wow. Until next time. I. Falkreath Cemetery reminds us that war is not new here. Got you. Let's see what's to this. Yes. Thing. What is it that you want? Nope. Oh well. Yeah, she probably got killed in the dragon attack. Probably earlier or some Hail shit. Hey, summoner, conjure me up a warm bed, would you? I conjure up a a dude that, that come after you. Let me see. And they don't even show the location of where she's at either. She just said, "Oh yeah, she's here by." She's by the. But I don't see nobody. She's supposed to be here cutting, uh, cutting wood. A girl. She always says honest work for honest pay. Probably the the dudes that got her. What do you need? Is there anything connected to this? Let me see. Let me look around. We got a cage. Nah. Yeah, they messed it up for me there. It's alright. We ain't worried about it no more. We'll come back to this this place later on. Is 
And sometimes it's annoying when stuff like that happens. You want you know, because I'm a type I like to complete all that shit. Inside. Take that off. Uh, trying to get that one. That's the kid. Find evidence that uh, you know what? Now that we're here, I'm gonna sell a whole bunch of. I, I totally forgot. I got stuff I can sell real quick before we leave. Yeah, the chick is not there. It's supposed to be somebody working that mill. Yeah, she 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 probably got killed by a dragon attack or some dumb shit. So I'm not worried about it. Which is kind of dumb, but. I can't believe we let provincials like you wander sky. Do you have any question? Well met. Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. See what he got real quick. What do you got? Potions. I always buy those. Get my yellow drum. Alright, let's sell some of the junk I got. I'll keep that Dietrich sword. We'll drop it off at the house. Yeah, you can have a silly rabbit tricks for kids. Right, let's get out of here. Steal anything from my shop and you'll regret it. Let's get out of here. I heard enough. Here you go, another one. Let's get out of here, man. I, I, this place is like freaking death and shit. Death drama is the word. Um, where's my other house? There you go. Oh, God. Are you serious? Oh, my God. There we go. That's what happened with the other boy. He got killed.
mate. Missile, man. My thing is, why was I, why, why was my life going low? Like, that made no sense. He's about to blast me. Right through that freaking armor, dude. Trying to get up there, but can't. Damn, boy, he's 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 uh, he's doing it. Let me put let me put this. Um, he's taking mad. Mad life from me. Like the stuff I couldn't carry. I think that's what happened. She was out in the outskirts and she got laid out with the fire. Huh. Alright, let's go. Let's go home. Someone there? Oh, shit. That's the last of them. Yeah, we put that work in. We put that work in. Come on, man. You can get rid of these, uh, these dudes right here. Give them a ride somewhere. I don't know where, but somewhere. <laughs>
Oh man. I trust you're not planning. <clears throat> Why the door closed? It never needs to be closed. I guess he went all out or something. Doors were always open. Alright, we got a Dietrich sword and a war axe that I could put in there. What else we could put in there? We could hang Mr. Vampire um, stuff on the wall because I don't need it no more. Let's get going. It has. Here, this is your half love. Damn, that's what I'm talking about. I can. Here, this is fresh. I'll have another one made tomorrow. What do you need to take? I don't think she got I think she got everything she needs, yeah. The steel bolts. She got the orcish arrows. I guess cause it has that you can swim on the water drone. Cause it has that um Taking that from her, so you can see her face. We're good. Let's go. I'll put this in here. Put the rings that I don't use. Yeah, because I got. Oh, where is that? There was a ring here that I, I had to put in here. But I forgot the name of it. There you go. Well, it actually goes in the basement, but that's alright. We'll put it there. Oh no. So far I got five of them, so keep it moving. Let's go. That's for the that's for the um And 
the firewood that I wanted to sell. I'll hold on to it. My skills up to 99 already? Let me see uh, the one hand of June. Right, my block is going up, so that's good. Okay. Is that 74? Actually, like, you know what? Because. Let's, um. So like that, I can keep um, using the bow. Let me see, and I can probably mess around and put some. Um, I can level up quicker too. Super Saiyan in the house, yo yo yo. Let me see. I'm trying to think where should I put it at. Mm. Let's check my two-handed John. This is the samurai, so this is what? Uh, deep cuts, critical with great swords. And this one's axe. I'm really not using any axe, but. Sweet. Sideway power attacks with two hands, hit all targets in front of you. Well, that's cool. Let me check out my one handed. Or oh, chopping people's heads off. Yeah, yeah. Let me stop. Paralyzing attack. That's a hundred. Trying to see where I'm going to put it at, bro, bro. Hmm. My man. Oh, I should go that that route. There you go. So that's two right there. Archery is about to be maxed out. So, nah, I'm not gonna worry about that. That's beast mode already. Hmm. Kind of weird, cause like I'm going this route. I mean, I got five of them. And like, I'm not I'm using the. We'll, li we'll leave that one just alone. We'll put it here because I, I do got to go there, so. And then we'll get that one next when it comes out. Because 100, 100 extra carrying points, bro, it's, 
It's a plus. Yeah, that's kind of weird though. Like you come, come to the crib and everything is uh. The doors are closed. Look at this. Look at this right there. They threw that shit to the side. Holy shit. What happened to the damn axe that was here? Mm. And why is this on the floor, dude? You know what I mean? I guess the weapon wanted to. It didn't want to be there. <laughs> Alrighty then. I guess it's because of this right here, man. You see something? See if I can put my axe somewhere. Probably in the room. We'll put it in the room. Hey. What do you need, my thing? I'm good. I'm just trying to put this book down. There you go. Let me see what weapons we got. I mean, that axe is nice, but I just don't like the way it looks. It looks crappy. weapons we got here do I got anything any weapons in here put it on the wall and shit D trick bow yeah well, well let's put that D trick on the wall damn Nah, son, that's that's the one I need. <laughs> wow. I oh. not putting that thing on the wall because it, it'll get lost when when it when it goes like that. When you see it kind of like an angle where it kind of like you feel it like kind of like it's going everywhere. See, that's the way it's supposed to, and then you put the shield on. But nah, that's all right. I ain't gonna take that chance that that, that D-Trick disappears through the wall. Come on, girl. She's like, take a little good night's sleep <laughs> in the boom boom room. <laughs> Technic is dumb too in the house, so they can they can live it if you know what I'm talking about. Yo, but that's crazy, dude. The the weapon rack is it on? Hold on, let me see something. Yeah, that weapon rack is whack. These are all the weapons that I had when I left it there. That's still there. Let's take out some stuff from the front room. 
Move the armory bench. The, the main entry. Yeah, the entry, main hall. I'll wait until I do 100% then I'll get that damn thing out. Alright, how's my weight looking? Weight is looking good. Uh, what the hell? Where the hell did I get that damn green sword? Anyway. We'll drop that off right here. Let me see. Take my time. Because sometimes you go real fast and you be missing shit. Look, look, look at it like this. Like, wow, where the hell did I grab that from? Uh, let's get out of here, bro. It's time to adventure. Too much time being, uh... Where is wifey? Oh, damn. Still the AO for this dude. I got skills like that. My shit's nice. You know what? That's the least of my problem. I don't need to steal on them Argonian. I can do that shit quick. Peek, take a shit. Let's see what we got. Yeah, it's funny though. It says investigate the boys, and I killed them all. <laughs> Let's see. All right, buddy. It's time to become full members of the, of the guild. Should we? Yeah, we should. All right, baby girl, you going home. I'm going to take her home real quick. And then we're going to go and we're going to bring it to full glory. Or should I say, uh, be the leader of the dudes? Because I wouldn't mind having the winch here. That's the shit. Uh, where is it at? Solitude. I know when, when, I, when I raise Solitude, we ain't going to be there. My family going to be somewhere else. <laughs> but I wonder if, if you do the war in Solitude, do you keep your house? Did they destroy it? You know what I mean, I hope they don't. Cool thing is they got the they got the kids, they were playing and you know. Oh damn, I forgot to put the um the Akujiki. You're not planning any trouble. What can I do for you, friend? Mm, we good. All right, wifey, you staying home? We've stopped. What is it? Uh, the kids. Oh, fine. So many guards on the street here, I hardly have to worry. Cool. All right, baby girl, you staying home? I'm heading home if you need me. The hell 
was that doing now? Oh. <laughs> Somebody threw that outside. He's like, oh, it's a plant. <laughs> Quest real quick. Uh, oh, guess I gotta um head the rift in. See how we're gonna do this one. Look, look, look around. Oh, they're not gonna tell you, huh? What time is it? Yeah, uh, they mad because I probably raided their crib, that's why. Don't miss out. Purchase a bottle of my genuine farmer blood elixir. Only 20 septums each. Glad to see you finally came to your senses. I do. Simple. I'm going to cause a distraction. You're gonna steal Medesi's silver ring from a strong box under a stand. Once you have it, I want you to place it in Branche's pocket without him noticing. Let me say real quick. That seems like it's a lot of work. <laughs> Glad to see you finally came to your senses. Ready to make some coin? Let's go. Simple. I'm going to cause a distraction. You're gonna steal Medesi's silver ring from a strong box under a stand. Once you have it, I want you to place it in Branche's pocket without him noticing. Well, plant the ring. There's someone that wants to see him put out of business permanently. That's all you need to know. Now, you tell me when you're ready, and we'll get started. Let's go. Why are you doing this to, to boy? We've been contracted to make sure Branche remembers not to meddle in affairs that aren't his own. Now, since we're not the Dark Brotherhood, we're not going to kill him. We're just going to make sure he sits in the prisons for a few days. Let's go. Good. Wait until I start the distraction, then show me what you're made of. Everyone, everyone, gather round. I have something amazing to show you that demands your attention. Do I got the, the thing set up already? Um. Hello, man. Busting locks like water. This would have been good to have the tower drill, right? <laughs> it should, it's, I should be able to get that even. It shouldn't be snapping like that. Sucker shouldn't be snapping like that, but uh, um, I 
Breaking more locks than I can make them. I get them. Another one? Jesus Christ, two fucking locks I got bust open. Crushed nerve. Oh shit, he got some loot. Mixed with water. Well, that was a simple misunderstanding. But this item is the real thing. Balma blood elixir. Oh come on! Are you talking about the snow elves? Think you can steal from me? Someone do something! I'm getting out of here. Never should have come here. Damn, they caught me good. I should have saved it when I did all that dumb shit. <sighs> yeah, once I I just thought he he wasn't gonna see me, but that means I gotta put on my 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 pit pocket stuff up. Let's see. I, I think I should have it. Unless I left it at home. Okay. Glad to see you finally came to your senses. Ready to make some coin? Simple. I'm going to cause a distraction. You're gonna steal Medesi's silver ring from a strong box under a stand. Once you have it, I want you to place it in Branche's pocket without him noticing. There's someone that wants to see him put out of business permanently. That's all you need to know. Now, you tell me when you're ready, and we'll get started. Uh, I'm ready when you are. Just give the word. Uh... Good. Wait until I start the distraction, then show me what you're made of. Everyone. Everyone, gather round. I have something amazing to show you that... It's your attention. You need to hear this. This way, everyone. Over here. Come on, Brignol. What is it this time? Yeah, what the hell? I'm trying to find it. The the rhythm, the rhythm, the rebel. Hold on. <laughs> Damn. There we go. 
That was quicker. This is a rip. Opportunity. I wouldn't want you to get left out. That's what you said about the wisp essence. And it turned out to be crushed nerve root mixed with water. I open that shit. Quit. Well, that was a simple misunderstanding. But this item is the real thing. But glasses I give you. Alright. Yeah, I am ready to go and plant this shit on. Blood elixir. Oh come on. Are you talking about the snow elves? The one and only. Mystical beings who live in legends. How did you get that? No one's seen them in years. My sources must remain a secret for their own protection, but I can promise you that the contents are genuine. One sip of the elixir and you See what this idiot want. Looks like I chose the right person for the job. And here you go. Your payment. Just as I promised. The way things have been going around here, it's a relief that our plan went off without a hitch. What's been going on? Uh, my organization's been having a run of bad luck. But I suppose that's just how it goes. But never mind that. You did the job, and you did it well. Best of all, there's more where that came from. If you think you can handle it. Money's nice, I don't know. No way. It's wrong, do these things. I can handle it. All right then. Let's put that to the test. The group I represent has its home in the Ratway beneath Riften, a tavern called the Ragged Flagon. Get there in one piece, and we'll see if you really got what it takes. Alright. Taking care of business, huh? <laughs> well. New around rifting? Take my advice. Stay at the B and Bar. The bunkhouse isn't for you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let me see. Buying and selling fine jewelry here. Run out your pockets. Let me get my put my sword on. I got that out the way. Cheeky blade. Well, not much more that went up. Like fifty-five. That's still good. So damn good. You all know, like, yeah. If you make it in one piece. Oh, you talking about them dudes I crossed and shit? These little, these two shitheads right here. and flag and what the hell ever not my first time being down here
I'm telling what do you me. think, my dear? This one is a beautiful woman like you. We've all heard that one. Well, before, well. Man. Call me an impressed lad. I wasn't certain I'd ever see you again. Oh, really? Well, Getting here was easy. Reliable and headstrong? You're turning out to be quite the prize. So, now that I've whetted your appetite with our little scheme at the market, how about handling a few deadbeats for me? Deadbeats? What they do? They owe our organization some serious coin, and they've decided not to pay. I want you to explain to them the error of their ways. Sounds good. Who are them? Kirava, Percy Honeyhand, and Helga. Do this right, and I can promise you a permanent place in our organization. How you want to handle it? Honestly, the debt is secondary here. What's more important is that you get the message across that we aren't to be ignored. A word of warning, though. I don't want any of them killed. Bad for business. Good. If you need any details on your marks, I'll be here. Now get going. What's Helga's story? Helga is a devout follower of Debella and dotes over the statue to the divine that she keeps at the bunkhouse. Use it as leverage and she'll cave. Kirava's stubborn, but she's got a soft spot for family. Talk to Tal and Jay at the B and Barb and see if you can get something out of him. Like They're they are. well acquainted, Come if you catch my meaning. Marry me. Let me take care of you. He's as pig-headed a man as you'll ever find. The key is that ugly dwarven urn in his shop. Smash that thing to bits and he'll change his attitude. Right, I'll that's be it. here when you're done. Easy cheesies, pops. Find these two real quick and knock it out. Alright, let's go find. Um, where is it? Taking care of business. Taking care of business. Smash. I could just tell him, I could just talk to all of them like yo pay your debt what my 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 talking is pretty high so they could just pay all the shit and that's it he might give me some extra loot for all that dumb shit let's go find these dudes real quick Got one next to my house. The B bar, huh? How this bunkhouse? Oh, <laughs> That's how we infiltrate. We take them all out. <laughs> we'll do some dumb shit that we fuck everybody up. <laughs> what do you want? Hold on. Let me put on. I'm gonna put this on the amulet of. How'd you meet? Let's 
I met her when I wandered into Riften a few years ago. Been smitten with her ever since. In fact, I'm thinking of asking her to marry me. In Blackmarsh, tradition dictates we present a potential mate a unique wedding ring to represent our future bond. I already have the gold band, but all I need are three flawless amethysts to complete the setting. Damn. I gotta I gotta do some stuff for this dude, man, but the hell. I told you about I was hoping you'd offer. I didn't think it was my place to ask such a favor of you. I thank you. He killed six Imperial Guards. Tell me about this wedding ring. Was this before or after the mythic dawn attacked the Emperor in the battle single handed? They're vermin. Garbage. They're exactly what makes this city such a horrible place to live. How appropriate they should live in the rat way with the rest of the trash. With the rumors going around about how poorly your guild's been doing, she's become much too bold. I'm not that foolish. The last thing I want is a war with your people. Look, I'm only telling you this because I care for her. Don't mistake this as acceptance for what you do. Kirava has some family at a farm just inside of Morrowind. If you mention you know about it, she might just listen to you. Just please don't harm anyone. I couldn't bear the thought. Every Argonian wedding proposal band is supposed to have three flawless amethysts as part of their design. Two of the gems, the ones on the outside, represent the couple to be married. One for the husband, one for the wife. The amethyst in the center represents the hist, the entity that all Argonians consider a sacred part of our lives. If you'll excuse me, I have other things to attend to. Have I told you about Valen, my dear? Here for a room or something to drink? Show me some coin first. Here, take a look at this. Some of the Jarl's men came by and left this bounty letter. No, and I never will. Now get out of my inn. How could you possibly know about... Please, my family means too much to me. Don't hurt them. Very well. Here, take this back to Brynjolf and tell him he'll have no more trouble from me. All right, done and done. We got the message. Just take your business elsewhere. We got the message. Now just take your business elsewhere. Guys, you did, Dragon Man. This ain't, this is bigger than you. A fine day to you, friend. May you die with a sword in your hands. Can I interest you in anything today? What? Oh, it's one of you people. So Brynjolf doesn't even bother to show up himself anymore, eh? What's this message? Simple. You don't pay. Simple. You don't pay. Bad things happen. You're order. gouging me for what little coin I make, and you can't even protect yourselves? Ridiculous. We can protect ourselves, trust me. Don't fool yourself. It's only a matter of time before you people are run out of Riften. I had enough of this. I think you should shut your mouth. Going to make you sorry for this. 
come on. By Get this mirror, you won't leave here alive. Come on, he's not so tough. Please, no more. I'll pay, I'll pay. Here. When is it going to end? I you hope you're I here for friendlier reasons now. After all, I'm all paid up. I hope Grinyol chokes on this gun. Don't worry, I'm gonna change shit up. Just gotta infiltrate. Sorry about that, everybody. I gotta do all that option, dumb shit. Too much work to break all that shit. I just go talk to him. Oh, your loot. That's the way I see it. I whooped his ass. Can I help you? Uh, what it's you? you. Please, don't hurt me. What is this place? This heap of matchsticks is what everyone calls Helga's bunkhouse. Can you stay here? No. The bunkhouse is for the working man, not some sort of luxury inn for tourists. Working man, what do you think? How much money do you think I got, dumbass? Anyway, I'm not broke. Let's go. I know who you are. You've been terrorizing the entire city. Please, there's no need for that here. Message understood. Here, I even have the payment. Thanks. Don't worry, I'll. I'll, I'll get things rolling. I'll fix shit up. Yeah, I just wanted to, I don't know, just kind of show it off a little bit, but it's not my style. Glad to see you finally came to your senses. Ready to make some coin? You're trying my patience, lad. Well, I'm going to take your punk ass out with an arrow. Keep playing. I'll get you later. Yeah, I'll do, I'll do that becoming a later on. I, I'm not. Uh, well, let's knock this one off. So we'll go do that one later. I think I should get wifey for that one. surrendered to the old Mary Dominion. They shamed us all. You know what? I'm going to have this boy come with me. And I'm going to make him I'm going to make him uh, what's it called? Um, Where's she at? Let me grab her real quick and make this one chick that I want her to make. Where's she at? There she goes. What do you need, my friend? Oh, hey there. I killed a bear yesterday. Did you kill anything? <laughs> no, a whole bunch of shit. Come on. Lead the way.
I'm gonna take her to Far Creek so she can become um what's that called? Um, um she become the what they call that thing? Um Where's the crew? She could become um kind of Stuart. Might as well. Yeah, I thought about doing it, but I was like, nah. I went back in time. I said, hell no. Can't do that to the menacing people. Probably my other character, but. I've got your back. I need a steward for this unit trip. I'd be honored to be your steward. You've built a fine steading here. All right. What kind of improvements can you got? Let me see. Of course. What room would you like me to furnish? This one. Hook it up. More house. Very good. I'll make all the arrangements. Certainly. What did you have in mind? Um. Get a bar. It would be pleasant to have some music in the house. I'll make some inquiries about retaining the services of a bard. All right. Hook it up. Farewell. Catch you later, skater. We'll make this house bigger later on. But for now, I think it's cool. We got her as a steward. I'm gonna take. I'm gonna see if I take this boy with me. Um, because this guy levels up. If you take him, Farkas. If you take him with you, he actually levels up. When you when you level up, he levels up. So I'm gonna take Farkas with me, and um, most likely I'll probably. Um, the other crib that I got, that I got, that I gotta make, I make him. Uh, maybe it'll change up because of um, I don't have the the I don't have it no more. So we'll, we'll take him with us. We'll take Farkas with us. Is that him? No, that's the assassin. Azura's wisdom to you, friend. Thanks, bro. He's probably down here. Just gotta find him. Mm -mm. No, he got his own bed. I know that for sure. That's wifey's old room. Yeah. Where is he? He's probably outside training. If they're not, if they're not in here, then he's probably training outside. He's not. Oh, okay, here we go. Nah. I'd be dead if not for Vignar. He took me in and helped me turn my life around. That's what's up. Hey. Let me double check. Uh, he's not there. Nah, he's probably outside. We're gonna take him with us. We're gonna do a couple stuff. May hey. the gods watch over your battles, friend. I wouldn't have expected someone like you to be the harbinger. But let's not waste any time. Let's go. Uh, 
we gotta go we gotta go talk to the king and yeah, we're gonna get some good gear and all that bullshit yeah because he levels up when you level up so that's that's pretty damn good Disrespect the law and you disrespect me. Let me persuade him. Let me put him on. Just in case. Matter of fact. We've stopped. What is it? What do you need to take? I'm gonna hook you up with some stuff because, um, stuff I got keep you alive. So he can look the part. I need that because of the um <sighs> I should give him the dragon bone. He's iron. Let's go. Let's go. What is it that you need? I need a, let me see. Trap a dragon. Uh, I must have misheard you. I thought you asked me to help you trap a dragon in my palace. I know I wouldn't ask if it wasn't important. Of course. You already saved Whiterun from that dragon. I owe you a great deal. But I don't understand. Why let a dragon into the heart of my city when we've been working so hard to keep them out? The threat's worse, you know. Adran has returned. Alduin. The world eater himself. But how can we fight him? Doesn't his return mean it's the end times? Only unless if we give up. I'm a dragon boy, just telling me to stop him. I don't know about such things. But I heard the Greybeard summon you. That's good enough for me. Now what's this nonsense about trapping a dragon in my palace? Only way is for us to I work. want to help you, Dragonborn. And I will. But I need your help first. Ulfric and General Tullius are both just waiting for me to make a wrong move. Do you think they will sit idle while the dragon is slaughtering my men and burning my city? No. I can't risk weakening the city while we are under the threat of enemy attack. I'm sorry. What if you didn't have to worry about enemy attack? Then I would be glad to help you with your mad dragon trapping scheme. But getting both sides to agree to a truce will be difficult at this point. The bitterness has gone too deep. Maybe. Hmm. What of the Greybeards? They are respected by all Nords. High Hrothgar is neutral territory. If the Greybeards were willing to host a peace council, then maybe Ulfric and Tullius would have to listen. Leave it to me, I'll talk to... So get, a, get a peace council. Aye, Dragonborn. Maybe you can stop the dragons and this war into the bargain. According to legend, although I never thought to put the tale to the test, Jarl Olaf One-Eye it was, 
who later became High King. They say he shouted it into submission in single combat atop Mount Anthor, and brought it back to Whiterun. Numenex was the dragon's name. That's his skull decorating the main hall. Oh. All right. Now, if you don't mind, I've got a city to keep. What's the... Get the graveyards and negotiate a truce. I don't know how we're going to do that. I don't know how we're going to pull that shizzle out. the dragon wren shout from here you defeated him yes but you escaped i need I need to find the poor old Sauron. i feared as much i thought it was him we saw flying east after your battle did you help to capture dragon we are not warriors what is overlooked in the dragonborn is not permitted to any other followers of the way of the voice I need to worry about capturing the dragon. I need your help to stop a war. You misunderstand our authority. The Greybeards have never involved themselves in political affairs. Yara won't help unless we bother with war. I see. The dragon will lead you to Alduin, but without the Jarl's help. Both sides respect the Greybeards, so they listen. Parthenax has made the decision to help you. This is the road we have to walk. Even the Greybeards must bend to the winds of change, it seems. So be it. Tell Ulfric and General Tullius that the Greybeards wish to speak to them. We will see if they still remember us. Now you see why I've warned you against them, bloodthirsty barbarians. If they are true. Yes. But understand, during the days of Alduin's rule, all dragons were his allies. There was nothing else they could be. If not for Parthenax, Alduin could not have been overthrown. It was he that first taught men to use the Thum. Oh, there you go. I haven't decided what to do yet. Don't worry. Ah, you're learning, Dragonborn. Doing nothing can be the wisest choice, although strangely often the most difficult. I trust that you will make the right choice in the end. Listen to the voice that Kinnereth has placed within you, and your path will be clear.
The old tales say that he can travel into Sovngarde to devour the souls of the dead. You must find out how he does this before he regains his strength and returns. Sky above, voice within. Sky above, words. I was to. Sky above, words within. Hopefully the, there'll be a peace treaty so they can calm the hell down. That'd be nice. Well, nobody has to fight each other. That'd be great. arms or armor you need, see Baron to Castle Dower. Good Are my men now giving free reign to anyone who wanders into the castle? Mm. Do you have some reason to be here, citizen? I was a Helga. Right. Helgen. One of the prisoners, if I recall correctly. I was set free, but I, let me see, I can no longer go anywhere. Oh, hell Watch no. Hmm, there's something I can do for you? Perhaps direct you to the nearest prison? Oh, man. Let me, let me reload that shit. I ain't trying to say it. I ain't fighting for his dumb ass. Shit. I could probably do that when I play it. You know what I mean? Uh, you know, do the. If you need potions, head over to Angeline's aromatics. Are my men now giving free reign to anyone who wanders into the castle? Do you have some reason to be here, citizen? An idiot. I believe we we already met. Have we? Oh, oh, of course. You were at Helgen, one of the prisoners, if I recall correctly. I was set free. I can, uh, I'm here to fight for the Empire. Oh man, I ain't trying to fight for these motherfuckers. I'm just, I'm here to 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 do you a favor, to chill, to. Oh man. I ain't trying to fight for him. I don't think so. Don't abide fancy clothes, but you look like you might. I hear Radiant Raymond has a large selection. Are my men now giving free reign to anyone who wanders into the castle? Do you have some reason to be here, citizen? Right, wow. Helgen. Planning an attack on White Run. He'd be insane to try. He doesn't have the men. I ain't trying to work with that. It says That's talk to him. It says talk to him, but... but my scouts report, sir. Every day more joining. Damn, the thing is my family's in here too, man. Fuck. <sighs> It 
me guess. Someone stole your sweet roll. I'll talk to uh, to Stormcloak. Well, I gotta talk to him first. I ain't trying to talk to freaking Teddy. Is the freaking idiot? Entire town. Damn college. Winter hold would never be the same. Should I got a team up with him with the star cloaks? I mean Falkleth won't give us a straight answer. He's a true Nord. He'll come around. That boy, that other boy's an idiot. What's his name? Uh Salius and shit. Don't be so sure of that. We've intercepted couriers from solitude. Only the foolish or the courageous approach a Jarl without summons. Do I know you? Um... Rosen Helgen. Ah, yes. Destined for the chopping block, if I'm not mistaken. I hoped or escape you said you had a vouch for me. Rayloff's alive. I hope that's true. He's a damn good man. But he hasn't returned yet, so I'll need to wait for his account. For now, speak with Galmar. I'm always looking for able fighters. Not everyone can say they made it out of Helga. Seems we're all branded villains these days. So long as your criminal past stays in the past, and you fight for me with honor and integrity, we'll welcome you into our ranks. And what would you have me do? Speak with Galmar. He'll size you up and see where we can best use your talents. It's about time they turned their gaze from the heavens back to our bleeding homeland. What do they want? A negotiated truce to deal with the dragon menace. I have the greatest respect for the Greybeards, of course. And the dragon attacks are a growing plague. But the political situation is still delicate. Not all the Jarls are fully committed to supporting me as High King. I can't afford to appear weak. I can't agree to this unless Tullius himself will be there. Pauses will be damned and all the way will win. Alduin, the world eater of song and legend. If that's true, well. It changes the situation, doesn't it? Even Tullius may be forced to talk sense in the face of such a threat. So the council... Yes. I'll give Tullius one more chance to quit Skyrim with his tail between his legs. If he's not with us, he's against us. He knows that. They all know that. The Stormcloaks are fighting are victory across the land. You think I need to send both rockets? Yo, he sound badass, bro. No doubt. I totally forgot how he sounds like. Gotta go find Tully. This a punk ass. He just thinks he's big shit, dude. Like, bro, he's an asshole, bro. Like, for real, for real. Like, like total freaking idiot, dude. I would have never said anything. I'm not going to lie to him. I, I would have not said anything. Like, nothing, nothing, nothing to him, bro. Like. I would have never told him I was a. I would have never said anything. He said, "You look familiar." I said, 
Well, everybody looks, looks familiar. I got a mask on you, dummy. So you, how the hell are you gonna wreck it? Yeah, we'll do the war and everything later on. I'm. Telling you. If you must venture south, planning an attack on White I remember you. You were at Helgen. Speak to Legged Ricka. I suspect we could use someone like you. That's not why I'm here. I see. Then there's nothing further to discuss. If you change your mind, speak with the Legate. I'm here for the, for the message of the Greybeards. The Greybeards? What do those old hermits want with me? They're convincing a... was it peace? Why? There's nothing to discuss as long as that traitor Ulfric is in arms against his rightful emperor. We had truce, the dragon the menace to deal with. They are getting to be a problem, but I wasn't sent to Skyrim to fight dragons. My job is to quell this rebellion, and I intend to do just that, dragons or no dragons. Dragon is a bigger problem. Storm closed right now. So. Uh, you may have a point. It's getting difficult to even move troops around without attracting a dragon attack. By all accounts, the Stormcloaks are suffering just as badly. Even Alfred might see the sense of a truce under these conditions. You may... So you'll come to a peace treaty then? Yes, yes fine, I'll come to this Greybeard Council. For all the good it will do. He'd be insane to try. He doesn't have the men. That's not what my scouts report, sir. Every day more join his cause. Yeah, I mean, like, so much. The boy is so full the of Gradius shit, called bro. The Peace Council at High Rothgar. And can you believe it? Both Ulfric, Stormcloak, and General Tullius have agreed to go. Yeah, I don't Done it. The men of violence are gathered here in these halls whose very stones are dedicated to peace. I should not have agreed to host this council. The Greybeards have no business involving ourselves in such matters. Don't worry, I'll get them to agree. Peace? <laughs> I doubt it. They may put their weapons down for a moment, but only to gather strength for the next bloodletting. They are not yet tired of war. Far from it. Do you know the ancient Nord word for war? Season unending. And so it has proved. But regrets are pointless. Here we are. Take your seat at the council table, and let us see what wisdom we can find among these warriors of Skyrim. So, Arngear, is it? 
You know why we're here. Are you going to let us in or not? You are not invited here. You are not welcome here. We have as much right to be at this council as all of you. More, actually, since we were the ones that put the Dragonborn on this path. We know what path you've set him on, but he has made a different choice. Parthenax is still safe from your malice. For now, the Blade's memory is long, as you know. Delphi, we're not here to rehearse your grudges. The matter at hand is urgent. Aldrin must be stopped. You wouldn't have called this council if you didn't agree. We know a great deal about the situation and the threat that Aldrin poses to us all. You need us here if you want this council to succeed. Ah, uh, very well. You may enter. Let's go. Why delay? Please take your seat so that we can begin. Now that everyone is here, please take your seats so we can begin. that we have all come here no. in the spirit you of... insult us by bringing her to this negotiation? Your chief Talos hunter? That didn't take long. Diplomat. Here, here. I have every right to be at this negotiation. I need to ensure that nothing is agreed to here that violates the terms of the White Gold Concordat. She's part of the Imperial delegation. You can't dictate who I bring to this council. Please, if we have to negotiate the terms of the negotiation, we will never get anywhere. Mm -hmm. Perhaps this would be a good time to get the Dragonborn's input on this matter. By Izmir's beard, the nerve of those Imperial bastards, eh? To think that I would sit down at the same table with that. Found more bitch. Either she walks or I do. Right to business. Found more has no business here. There's no harm, Tellius really, what's the harm besides Tellius doesn't really want her here either. She's right, Tom Moore has no business here. That's true, that's, that's technically true. What's the harm? What's the harm besides Tellius doesn't really want to be here? She's right, the Tom Moore has no business here. Hey, well, technically. It's true, they, they don't really have to, they don't... I'm glad we agree on this. Very well, Ulfric. Enjoy your petty victory. The Thalmor will treat with whatever government rules Skyrim. We would not think of interfering in your civil war. Ha! Skyrim will never bow to the Thalmor. Unlike your Imperial friends here. You're lucky I respect the Greybeard's council, Galmar. Like it. <clears throat> we represent the Emperor here. Sorry, sir. It won't happen again. Now that that's settled, may we proceed? I have something to say first. Here we go. The only reason I agreed to attend this council was to deal with the Dragon Menace. There's nothing else to talk about. Unless the Empire is finally ready to renounce its unjust claim to rule over the free people of Skyrim. I knew he wouldn't be We're able to We're here to arrange a temporary truce to allow the Dragonborn here to deal with the dragons, nothing more. I consider even talking to the Empire a generous gesture. Are you done? 
Did you just come here to make speeches, or can we get down to business? Yes, let's get this over with. Are we ready to proceed? Jarl Ulfric, General Tullius, this council is unprecedented. We are gathered here at the Dragonborn's request. I ask that you all respect the spirit of High Hrothgar. Yeah, Do your best so. to begin the process of achieving a lasting peace in Skyrim. Who would like to open the negotiations? Yes, let's get down to it. We want control of Markar. That's our price for agreeing to a truce. So that's why you're here, Ulfric? You dare to insult the Greybeards by using this council to advance your own position? Jarl Elisif. General, I'll this is outrageous. This. You can't be taking this demand seriously. I thought we were here to discuss a truce. Elisif, I said I'd handle it. Ulfric, you can't seriously expect us to give up Markarth at the negotiating table. You hope to gain in council what you've been unable to take in battle, is that it? I'm sure Jarl Ulfric does not expect something for nothing. Yes, that'd be entirely What would the Empire character. want in return? Wait, General, you don't intend to just hand over Markarth to that... traitor? This is how the Empire repays us for our loyalty? Enough. First, let's be clear. This council wasn't my idea. I think it's a waste of time. You are a traitor to the Empire, and deserve a traitor's death. But I at least will negotiate in good faith. Since we're all here at your request, I'd like to hear what you think Markarth is worth. How about Riften? Dark Star C to be a patriot. Uh, seems to like a fair trade. About Riften. Hmm. The Rift would help secure our communications with Cyrodiil and threaten Ulfric's southern flank. The Dragonborn has spoken, Talius. Markarth will be ours. Now we'll see if there's anything behind your talk of good faith. You disappoint me, Dragonborn. I accepted your invitation on trust in your good name. But it seems you intend to favor Ulfric. I can see now that this is not a negotiation at all. I know you, Ulfric. If I hand over Markarth, you'll be ready with a new demand. You'll never defeat the Empire, and you know it. But you're willing to sacrifice thousands for your own selfish ambition. Soon enough, I'll have you back under the headsman's axe, and this time there won't be any dragon to save you. As always, the Empire's fine words are worth nothing. Stop! Are you so blind to our danger that you can't see past your pity disagreements? Here you sit arguing about nothing, while the fate of the land hangs in the balance. Is he with you, Delphi? If so, I advise you to tell him to watch his tongue. Let him he talk. is with me, and I advise you both to listen to what he has to say before you do anything rash. Don't you understand the danger? Don't you understand what the return of the dragons means? Alduin has returned, the world eater. Even now he devours the souls of your fallen comrades. He grows more powerful with every soldier slain in your pointless war. Can you not put aside your hatred for even one moment in the face of this mortal danger? I don't know about the end of the world, but this dragon situation has gotten out of hand. If this truce will help the dragonborn here put an end to that menace, we both gain. Remember that, Ulfric. Now, back to the matter at hand. You know as well as I do that we can't hand over Markarth on these terms. Damn Imperial arrogance. Let's hear it. We want compensation for the massacre at Carthwaston. You slaughtered the very people you claim to be fighting for. True sons of Skyrim would never do such things. Damned Imperial lies. My men would never stoop to such methods, even in retaliation for this your is our land, at... Tolius. 
All the blood spilled in this war is on your head. Yeah. So, Dragonborn, what do you say? Morpheus should be compensated. What happened? Why do you say? Well said. For once you'll actually pay for your crimes. I suppose that's the fairest deal we're likely to get. It seems we may have an agreement. Jarl Ulfric, General Tullius, these are the terms currently on the table. Markarth will be handed over to Ulfric's forces, Jarl Igmund will step down, and Thangvor Silverblood will become the Jarl of Markarth. The Stormcloaks will withdraw from the Rift, allowing Imperial troops unhindered access. Jarl Leila Lawgiver will step down, and Maven Blackbriar will become the Jarl of Riften. The Stormcloaks will pay appropriate compensation for the massacre at Carthwaston. You both agree to this? The Sons of Skyrim will live up to their agreements, as long as the Imperials hold to theirs. What about you, Elisif? Are these terms to your liking? Speak up! I'm sure General Tullius is waiting to do your bidding. I have nothing to say to that murderer. General, you've proven yourself a good friend to Skyrim. I continue to trust that you will do your utmost to safeguard our interests. Thank you, Jarl Elisif. I appreciate your loyalty. The Empire can live with these terms, yes, for a temporary truce, until the Dragon Menace is dealt with. After that, Ulfric, there will be a reckoning. Count on it. Come on, Galmai. We have a lot of work to do. Giving up Markarth is a heavy price for this truce, Dragonborn. I hope it was worth it. Jarl Balgruf, I assume you are familiar with the Dragonborn's plan? Yes, I'm ready to do my part. Just say the word, and my men will help you spring this trap. But the difficulty remains. How to lure a dragon to Dragon's Reach at all? Well, that's an excellent question. You haven't overlooked that little detail, have you? Ah, I believe I can be of help here. I anticipated the problem. While you were arranging this meeting, I was busy in the library of Skyhaven Temp, an unguessed trove of lost lore. But the important thing is that the Blades recorded many of the names of dragons they slew. Cross-referencing this with Delphine's map of dragon burial sites, I believe I've identified one of the dragons that Olvin has raised up. How does it help us? How does that help? Don't you see? The names of dragons are always three words of power. Shouts. By calling the dragon with a voice, he will hear you wherever he might be. Why will he come when he's called? He's not compelled to, but dragons are prideful by nature and loath to refuse a challenge. Your voice in particular is likely to intrigue this dragon after your victory over Aldrin. I think it's very likely that he will be unable to resist investigating your call. So what is this dragon's ah, name? indeed. I'm no master of the voice. Like these, worthy gentlemen. But it is written here, in the scroll. Oda Vin. Winged Oda Vin. snow hunter, as I read it. I hope this truth gives you the It won't last. We have nothing to talk about until Parthenax is dead. Alright, cool. Say no more. You with the attitude. Shit. I mean, it's like everybody's freaking bugging, yo. Like, the hell.
Where is it? Am I gonna unlock it? Where's the new one? Call the dragons. Well, it's alright, because if it gets stupid, I just come after both of y'all and shit and keep the peace rolling. Oh, stupid and shit, fighting for some land and shit that don't even belong to them, belongs to the people. They dumb as shit. Well, everybody, I'm gonna leave it off here, because, um, gonna um get something to eat though but stay awesome stay great everybody thanks for um for hanging out with me and the rest of the crew we'll rock some more later on big shout out to my brother super saiyan goku 2425 better known as the super saiyan show yeah so i'll holler back everybody and we'll see everybody again thanks again bye bye